Hi guys, Simon's from Funbossy Toys. Now, just making a quick video um, about the GT Power Pro again. Um, a lot of people still asking me how to program most of the function um, on their remote. But I only can show you what I did on my remote, which is Trinity. So it might be different from Futaba, Spectrum, Fly Sky, or whatever FL Sky. So just give you a bit idea um, how I did. Um, so um, yeah, here we go. Um, okay, with the um, transmitter, you need to. Set to the endpoint, which is the limit on this remote. So every every remote is called differently. So the the channel one, two, three, four. Try to set not too high, because this one maximum is a hundred. And the train do. Three, shoot twenty three, and channel four on my remote. Your remote may be different; might be on two or three or three or four. Then, but on my one, which is three, up and down on the elevator, and the channel four. Um, I was set to seventy five. On twenty three and eighty on channel four. The reason why I need to set it to that low because I need to calibrate. I need to calibrate. So once you set to the eighty, now it's eight hundred now it's hundred, but before it's eighty. Once everything's done to all the calibration, you can go back to one hundred. But before you come to that point, you have to go down to uh, 75 on 23, both number, and then 24 has to be 80 or a little bit lower, doesn't matter. Um, and then you do all the calibration. So you have to let the GD Power module know what's actually your uh, transmitter each channel um, the limit of each channel when in neutral trim okay once everything is done all the calibration done and then you go back go back to here go back to 100 so before was I was I was set it to seventy five when I do all the calibration. Okay, seventy five. Once I done all the cal calibration, I come back here, set it to hundred maximum. All right. Then back to the mixer. So. I have to written down, <laughs> but there's now all different numbers now. So try to set it, all the function that I want for each, for some of the switches. So, so throttle hundred percent, and then high beam I got hundred and ten weight, um, elevator I got hundred percent, which is uh, steering. So, so elevator, sorry, elevator, which is for that up and down, which is going, doing all, um, a push down will be the, all the headlights mode. Push up will be headset light. Um, and the router will be 100. So, which is here, changing gear, 
or doing neutral and then the fifth gear just this now i've got a circle here to represent that motion i'll show you later now and of course you can use the air to do all the things now and also i can show you when i press the button you can see it's changing no hang on okay here we go let's get a start i show you what i did okay you can see you may or may not I'm not sure yeah okay here we go people can see we are kind of in the middle trim okay and that's all the button but some of the button ha haven't had anything yet so so probably nothing hope you can see it better here we go let's start it Okay, of course you need to pair to your mobile phone via Bluetooth. So go into the app. Oh, it's already paired it. So if I turn on the light, oh hang on, yeah, here we go. For the light function, you can use the apps. Fine as well. Off. Okay, now. If I gotta use all the the button that I set early, so that's the hazard light. See that? Okay, you can go on the app. You can see hazard light is turned on. Let me see where are you. Okay, here we go. So dangerous flash light switch. Try again. See, let's go off. Okay, headlight. Then I will go to the front. Look at this, keep changing. One, two, three. Just turn down the volume. Okay, now. There's a lot of people asking me how to set, how to get it right on the, um, the fifth channel, which is a trailer hook, and um, the neutral, neutral switch. Okay, so, okay, here we go. What I did is this one. Now, this one on the left, see, it's no more neutral, so the wheel will turn, okay, Back to neutral. Do one more time. You can see. Sorry. We were just able to see that switches. Try again. Now is the wheel is dry. Now go to neutral. Then the wheel doesn't move. Okay. One more. Fifth channel. Now this one is on. If I switch to fifth channel, this one will be control that servo. This, the horn will <coughs> will not operate. So this switch 
this one I did. Turn. See that? Now you change to draw bar servo. So it'll be hard to see. Try again. Oh, sorry. The bed to the loudspeaker. One more time. You go to the So now you can see the servo running. Alright, if I go back to home again, the servo doesn't move. Okay, last one will be the engine store. So the motion will be go to headset light and then this the fifth wheel servos. So which is up, down, do it together. So that will engine stop. Start again. So all done. So I hope this video can uh, give you a bit idea how to set up your own transmitter to GD Power Pro. Thank you.